Batman, the dark and gritty superhero, the serious psychological exploration of fear. Every once in a while, we finally get the dark and gritty Batman movie we deserve as a society. What are you? I'm Batman. No, that's not gritty enough. We need a more serious and even grittier Batman movie. Where are you? Here. No, no, we need a movie grittier than that. Do you bleed? You will. Grittier. Grittier! When that light hits the sky, it's not just a goal, it's a warning. I'm vengeance. The more up its own ass with seriousness that Batman gets, the more we need to step back and remember that... Batman is an inherently silly concept. Bat signal for listeners who might not know, refers to the children's character, the Bat-Man, a strong gentleman who fights crime nocturnally. That's correct, well put. Even some of those serious Batmen need to point out the silliness just to make themselves feel better about engaging in it. Well, a guy dresses up like a bat clearly has issues. <laughs> and look, I'm not saying that the gritty takes on Batman are bad or wrong, I'm just saying that I really enjoy takes on Batman that embrace the silliness inherent. So for this list, I'm going to talk about my six favorite comedic versions of the Caped Crusader. Some of these are official Batman projects that happen to take a more comedic tone, others are unauthorized parodies, but for this list, they're all Batman. I'm not including any original characters who are parodies of Batman, no matter how direct of parodies they are. <laughs> To make this list, they can be authorized or not, but the characters have to be named Batman. And I'm not including anything where other characters just dress up as Batman, no matter how much I love quite a few of them, and no matter how much one of them claims to count. Abed is Batman now, Christian Bale. So without further ado, quick to the Bat list. Mm -hmm. 